From LA Late News headquarters in Santa Monica, this is the Midday Report on LA Late. It's a big day, day here on LA Late with incredible great news about your fourth stimulus check update of 2022. In today's recording, we'll go over the routing times of all these incredible checks and what are land in your hands. We're going to go over checks that are reality, they're a law, and how quickly you can get them. We'll go over that check, hey, a $6,500 stimulus check became law March 31st, how quickly you can get it in your hand. A fifteen dollars to $80,000 check became law March 4th, how quickly you can get it in your bank account. $24,000 MSC checks became law in 2021. Many of you are getting upwards of $150,000. How quickly you can get these automatic checks, $2,000 a month for upwards of 12 months from Joe Biden in your hand. Then we'll be going over the other checks that are coming in the horizon, which are not law yet. Plus, we'll be going over that soon. Loan debt forgiveness, the routing time on that. We'll be going over the latest routing time on six stimulus, the latest time on that. This stimulus, the routing time for the SSI reform. Plus, we'll be looking at the developing, developing details of that six stimulus package, the largest one of a generation to battle the recession. But you know how this channel works. The second half of Home LA is always about your food and your deliciousness. In today's recording, we have a lot of deliciousness, whether it is the deliciousness of dessert <laughs> or whether it's the deliciousness of some cake, you know, Brussels sprout sugar-free cake, as Bob Bacon hilariously once said. We'll have all that deliciousness in today's recording. In fact, in today's recording, we have some big surprises. We're not only going to get the bread, we're also going to get the big bread that is eat edible. <laughs> In today's recording, we go over some wonderful olive bread and some wonderful cheese jalapeno bread, Anne's favorite. We'll go over how to get this wonderful bread because guess what? It's only delicious if it's, if it's in your hand, reoccurring cheese bread per month. Mm, yum. The deliciousness of home ally heats up right now with monthly cheese bread hitting in your bank account. With those eaters and more, all from the shores of Santa Monica, California, it's noontime, and it starts right now. And good day, everybody. Hope you're having a beautiful day. Whether it's Brussels sprout chocolate cake <laughs> or whether you're taking a zucchini boat down the river to see a Doja Cat music video, we got it all covered in today's hysterical home LA broadcast. But not so hysterical as those great checks. Wow. We're going to go over those incredible checks and the rowdy times. Their stimulus checks, their law, they're being sent out. They're automatic. They're from Joe Biden and virtually all the viewership of this channel. Get it. We're going to go over those checks in just a second. If you're new to home LA, let's go over what we cover in today's recording. First half of the video is your stimulus check second half of this video is your stimulating your appetite i'm going to go over that in just a second where are we right today as we are right today in the month of april there are a series of checks that are now law automatic great checks huge checks from four stimulus and also from before and thereafter that have been sent out from joseph biden so let's go over the details of each of those checks in your hands what's important to understand is that over this recording we're going to show you the checks their routing times and also checks that are not law and when they're likely to come law and land your hands as well. Three checks have now become a law. And to get those checks, get that pen and paper ready, put down that chocolate cake. We're going to get to it in just a second. We're going to go over how to get each of these checks right now. The first one is a $6,500 stimulus check. The second one is a $15,000 to, 15 to $80,000 stimulus check. And the third one is an MSC, a monthly stimulus check that averages about $2,000 a month over 12 months. But many of you are getting over $45,000 to $150,000. What are those three checks? Let's go over each of those three checks right now and their routing times. First, their routing times. They generally land about one month, uh, one week after approved. And if it's a reoccurring check, then it lands every single month thereafter. So let's look over those, let's look over these incredible checks right now. The first check is a $6,500 stimulus check. 
In many states, this is check A. In many states, this check um, pays a lot more. Check A is $6,500 in some states upwards of $12,000. When did it become a law? It became law in late March when Joseph Biden, your president, took it out of the Build Back Better Act and made it a law by executive action authority. It's a four stimulus check. And the eligibility is the same as a third. Single individual, $75,000 less, you can get it. Married couple, if your annual income is $150,000 less, you can get it. And if you own a home, you can get it as well, because this is the homeowner's weatherizing grant check. So if you're on SSI, SSDI, VA benefits, and you own a home, you can get it. Congratulations. So how do you get this incredible check? You become a member. The link's at the top of the chat and in the pinned comment. Become a Purple Hawk, Purple Power, or Calcino VIP today. You see people in the live chat that have an emoji of a hawk next to their name. They are members. Then, watch for that newsletter that's delivered Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, via the YouTube Alerts. The YouTube Alerts will send that membership newsletter, and then you go right in there and pounce. Check A is right at the top of the newsletter, under the price of gasoline and wheat and corn today. And it says homeowners weatherizing grant check. Then it'll give you a little bit more details, a little bit more explanation. And then it'll give you the link, the web link, the internet web link that sends you into the online application. A national website that is run by the federal government that sends you then to your state. And then you choose homeowners grant, homeowners weatherizing grant check. So let's say it's Alabama. It would say Alabama weatherizing grant check. Apply and bounce. And then the rounding time is about one week thereafter. If you got the application approved, you're going to get funded that quickly. Check B looks like check A. Why? Because it has a lot of similarities. But the money is a lot more money. Fifteen dollars to $80,000. Now, understand, we have never had a fifteen dollars to $80,000 stimulus check on this channel, with the exception of those MSC checks coming up in check C. This is an enormous, enormous check. What is this? This is a forced stimulus check as well. Joseph Biden took it out of the forced stimulus package. Made it a law by executive action, and it pays out fifteen to eighty thousand. The viewership of this channel is tracking at about sixty six thousand to eighty thousand dollar checks. Yes, you heard me right. A sixty six thousand dollar stimulus check. This is enormous. The first stimulus check was twelve hundred dollars. The second one was six hundred dollars. The third one was fourteen hundred dollars. This is eighty eighty thousand dollars on the high end, but tracking about sixty six thousand to eighty thousand. That's what I do on this channel. I give people big checks. I don't have time for small, minuscule checks. I have time to get you big sums of money so that you have financial freedom for months to come. Eligibility same as the third stimulus check, and just like the A check. Single individual, $75,000 less, you can get it. Married couple, $150,000 less, you can get it. And if you're a veteran and you own your home or you're a senior on SSI and you own your own home or, or Social Security, you can get this as well. How do you get check B as well? You do it the same way, just lower on that newsletter. You become a member, then go lower on that newsletter right below A, and then it says B. The website is different as well. It'll send you into the national website, which then has a map. You choose your state, like Tennessee. Click the state of Tennessee. And then it goes into the state of Tennessee. You apply. This is for homeowners' items besides just weatherizing. That's why it's a lot more money, like home repairs. Wow. When we talk about A, B, and C, you all qualify for either A, B, or C. I got to check for anyone on this channel. A and B and C are for homeowners. C is for renters. So if you're a renter, you get C. And if you're a homeowner, you can get A, B, and C. So let's turn to check C. Check C is a monthly stimulus check, an MSC. Made law in 2021. It is an MSC monthly stimulus check. And the money is astronomical. Viewers in recent days have gotten for Joseph Biden automatic checks of $2,000 a month for 12 months, $24,000. But viewers have been getting this since last year, and they were averaging about $45,000 then. Many viewers gained over $150,000. Let's go over some success stories first before we go over the elements of how to get it. Here are some numbers for the check C. Yeah, there you go. $27,000 checks. 22000 Sometimes it's broken out into a monthly check, and they get it on a monthly basis. Here's utilities. Look at these huge, huge checks. Let's look at the combination of these checks. Wow, $32,000. Here is more combinations of these checks. Mark, which is $100,000. Now he's at over... He was at $50,000. Now he's at over $100,000. Lorraine, she was at one hundred five. Now she's at one twenty. So how do you get these check Cs? Unlike check A and B that involves going to a website and applying... 
Check C involves going to your phone and picking it up and calling. So who do you call? What do you say? And how quickly do you get approved? You'll get approved literally sometimes within the spot. I had viewer uh, Johnny, who was starting on Monday. By Wednesday, got three programs approved, $45,000. By the end of the week, he had called 17 places, got eight approved, got $80,000. You're going to reach out to your city hall, your city housing authority, your county hall, and your county housing authority. Also, your state hall and your state housing authority. Now, let's stop the graphic right there. That's six places, but if you're a member, the membership newsletter features the nonprofits on top of that. They give you other sums of money. And that was what Johnny did. He reached out all those places. That's why he reached out to 15 places in seven days, five days, and got $80,000 approved. Very common story on this channel. You're going to say rent assistance because of COVID, utility assistance because of COVID, mortgage assistance because of COVID. You don't say unwords. They don't say words that they don't know, like stimulus check, waivable check, or lobster shorts decor. Hot couture. <laughs> you don't say those words. Uh, and there you go. You reach out to those six places, put multiple applications file, and then do these checks as long as you can do it. Viewers, on average, are getting a lot of money, averaging 45000 Get that membership newsletter, because the membership newsletter includes the nonprofits, and the nonprofits pay for other sums of money across the board. These are monthly stimulus checks. They are huge checks. Joe Biden made them law. They are for all of you, averaging about $2,000 a month for over 12 months in the recent days. But viewers before that gaining $45,000. Do it today. That is, my friends, check C. Check C is astronomical. The routing time on check C is as soon as you make the phone call, you'll generally find out within about 24 hours to 40 hours if that program is approved. Assuming it's approved, then you move on to the next one. You're going to have about, uh, you're going to get some rejections. You're also going to get some yeses. If you get a yes, don't stop. Keep on pushing. And remember, how do you learn about all these incredible details? Become a member. That membership newsletter link is, membership link is at the top of the chat in the pinned comment. Become a Purple Hawk, Purple Power, or Calcino VIP. Then get that membership newsletter Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time via the YouTube alert system. Let's go over the other checks their routing times, their future, and a little bit of tough love before we go into some delicious food and some more bread. <laughs> Let's go over the details right now. You know, what I've always done since day one of this channel, as this channel approaches its two-year anniversary, April 25th, 2022, is I get people money. Not five days from now, not five weeks from now, not five months from now, today. And as the landscape is evolving, and a lot of people are looking, a lot of people are waiting for people to tell them that there's something for them in the future that fits sort of their mindset of what they want. And I have seen that across the landscape, and it's quite sad. People want to hear things like automatic, everyone, coming, just made law, doing it today, doing a landscape. And what causes that behaviorism is for people not to deal with the present and to look outward. What you need to do today is you need to get all these three checks, A, B, and C. You need to get these three checks. Because if you're a homeowner, across the three checks, you got over $100,000. And if you're a renter, over the cost of the three checks, you're going to at least $24,000. Averaging $45,000, many viewers, over $100,000. That's a lot of money. It's more than the first stimulus package, it's more than the second stimulus package, and it's more than the third. Now let's take a reality check of what's on the horizon. SS300 is absolutely incredible. It needs to be done relatively quickly. Joe Biden made that swath and cold into inflation. And that raise your benefits up $200 more per month every month starting the month he does it. Lifetime. And over the next 12 months, that would be great. But it hasn't happened yet. Then, for stimulus and the Build Back Better Act, never, ever, ever ask what day are they voting on the Build Back Better Act. Because if you've got if you've not gotten A, B, and C, you should not be focusing on the vote on something that isn't scheduled yet. Moreover, what's actually worse detrimentally to you and your financial independence is saying, when is the IRS MSC check landing in my direct deposit account? Folks, that literally needs a hand slapping for when you say that. Why? Let's do the reality check right now. The IRS MSC check, they represent, they promise, they represent, they're going to put it into the Build Back Better Act, which is not law. 
So you're basically dependent upon two events, that the Build Back Better Act becomes law and that they do what they say they're going to do. But let's go along with that so far. How many checks, how, many, how much payout? $2,000 the first month, $1,000 thereafter for up to six months. That's $7,000. $7,000. I just showed you MSE checks that are averaging $24,000. It's 300% more, and it's right today. And many of you are getting $45,000. That's 800% more money. And some of you are getting over $150,000. Would you rather have $45,000 or $7,000? Why? Because you're afraid to pick up the telephone? You're not afraid to pick up the telephone. I know you. You are not. So that is the reality check. Now, if you want both of them, that's fine. That's fine. You want the third symbols MSE check and you want the fourth symbols, re fourth symbols MSE checks. But don't pass up. Do not leave on the table all these incredible checks at A, B, and C because guess what? You're going to see it tonight on A's Light at prime time. Our five o'clock major show, biggest financial show in prime time on in America and today, that there is now a lot of moving forces, conflicting forces of this economy. Some parts of the economy are looking great. Some parts of the economy are stalling out. And if the economy ultimately stalls out, if we go into recession, which I'm predicting we are, and why I'm predicting that two parts of the economy are currently recession, auto and the housing industry, if we go into recession for two years, guess how much money you're going to need? You're going to need a lot. So that's why you don't pass up money that's available today because you think that the situation looks so rosy on the horizon. Let me do it in another way. In the last 60 days, the federal governor, Jay Powell, his approach to raising those interest rates has become much more aggressively than just 60 days ago. He said maybe a quarter basis point, now he's saying a half basis point. And today the landscape is that the economy and the analysts and myself now believe that Jay Powell does not have the tools to reduce inflation. What does this mean? If he does not have the tools to reduce inflation, he's going to raise your interest rates. Bad for anything you pay on debt, credit card debt, student loan debt, car payment debt. Very bad if he raises interest rates and he doesn't solve inflation. It's coming up tonight on Indies LA. That is why you got to cash these checks that are available right today. And these checks can be bigger and bolder because viewers do get bigger and bolder checks across the board. When we look at Mark, who had 50000 he didn't stomp because guess what? If you were watching this channel back then... Uh, about seven months ago, I said to Mark on camera, he had gotten three items, 25,000, 6,500, and 19,000. I said, Mark, was your third item? He got it. Excuse me. He had not gotten snap. He had gotten renting utilities. He had not gotten snap. I said, Mark, was your third item? He went and got 50,000. He didn't stop there. He got 120,000. He didn't stop there. He has now come back and gotten one of the A, B, and C checks. One of those A, B, and C checks, which one did he get? He got B. <laughs> he got another 66,000. You remember one of our volunteers, Brother Joshua? Brother Joshua sent me a beautiful message yesterday. He said, hey, Ellie, I got in check A and B. Congratulations to him. That is how you pounce as a Purple Hawk. Now, student loan debt forgiveness, what's its rounding time on that one? That is just a few weeks away. The president has March, May 2nd as the deadline to determine the future of that student loan debt forgiveness. We'll feature more about his opportunities on Evening's LA. That is the May 2nd rounding time on the student loan debt. What about four stimulus? When is the rounding time on four stimulus, the Build Back Better Act? That, I think, would potentially be in the next 30 days. Also, potentially in the next 30 days, actually, let me rephrase it, has to be in the next 30 days, is six stimulus. They don't do it in the next 30, 30 days. We go in a recession. I mean, that's sort of the landscape of where it is. Six stimulus is the largest stimulus package we've seen in a generation. That is the big money to solve the oil, the wheat, the grain, and the housing industry. The concept is that you raise deficit spending to give stimulus to your citizens. Those details are more, but you know what the second half is about? <laughs> it's about that deliciousness, whether it's chocolate cake, whether it's Brussels sprouts, or whether it's chocolate cake, Brussels sprouts, <laughs> sugar-free. We're going to cover that later in the second half. No, we're going to cover bread, delicious olive and jalapeno and rosemary and sun-dried tomatoes. But first, become a member. Get that incredible newsletter Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time via the YouTube alert system. If you're watching the show live, jump in the live chat. I'll be able to answer your questions after the commercial break. Have any questions about stimulus? Have any questions about chocolate cake? Have any questions about delicious bread coming up in the second half of this video? I'll be jumping in the live chat with you as well. But first, become a member. Purple Hawk, Purple Power, Calcino VIP. We're just getting started. As the deliciousness heats up at home, LA, from the shores of Santa Monica, California, I'll see you back in 60 seconds with the latest details and how to choose the right 
delicious bread. But first, here's a little bit about the Members Community page. If you want money right now, not five days from now, and not five weeks from now, then reach out to the Community page. The volunteers can help you find that money for rent and utilities. That's at news.la.com forward slash community. The Community page features a series of volunteers who are viewers like you. They can help you find rent, utilities, SNAP, food benefits, mortgage assistance, and help you with eviction moratorium questions as well. Their Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram individuals reach out to them and indicate the city and state you're from, and they'll get back to you shortly. That's a community page. Volunteers working for you, viewers helping one another. Stay with LA for more. Join LA Late Daily for the excitement of the new LA Late Live Daily. The excitement starts on mornings LA Late at 9 a.m. LA Late returns at 11 a.m. daily. And then afternoons LA Late at 1 p.m. Join us daily as the excitement continues live from Santa Monica on LA Late. And the excitement continues in the second half of Noontime LA. You know, the second half of this video is always about deliciousness of cakes, cookies, dessert, beauty, and home and decor. And it's also about answering your questions. And during the commercial break, new members join. Whoa, a lot of wonderful. Welcome Gary to the family. He became a member during the commercial break. Welcome to the incredible family, Gary. And also becoming a member during the commercial break was Stephanie. Welcome, Stephanie. She became a Purple Hawk. A lot of uh, interesting things you need to know. And one of the things I want to address, one of the questions that came up during the commercial break before we get to the deliciousness of some great bread was one viewer said, some people don't apply for these, don't qualify for these things because they don't live in a home. They don't have a home. They're homeless. Let me address that question because I've seen it grow in recent days. When you look at the Build Back Better Act, the Build Back Better Act is based upon a series of elements such as dental or vision or or health care or home care or uh or nutrition or student education or home repairs or uh buy an electric car or education when you look at build back better act there's nothing really in the core of it that says here's a check don't do anything here's a here's a blank check go spend it the only thing that looks potentially like that is the potential assertion of an MSC check IRS. So let's understand that, is that Build Back, Better Back, Build Back Better Act's mentality, it's, it's a mental approach to the stimulus package, is not just to send you a check. And so I understand the, the situation that a lot of homeless people have across the country. But if your focus is just to get a check for no other purpose but a check, it's a check that you spend however you want to spend for any purpose, that landscape is very narrow. That landscape is very narrow. And that is not where your mentality should be because that's not where their mentality is. Their mentality of Build Back Better Act is not that they want to spend $3 trillion and then have, give it to you and you can sp spend the check however you want to spend it. Let me say it in another way. Their concept of Build Back Better Act is not we're going to spend $3 trillion. Here it is. You go spend it how you want to spend it. That's not their mentality. Their mentality is we have a lot of things that you have bills for and we want to fix your bills. And so I want you to be focused on where their focus is as well. I don't want you to think that there is a universe in which they're not focused on paying your bills and just giving you a check and say, here, here's a check. We don't care what your, what bill, we don't care if it's for the bills or not for the bills. That's not their mentality. When we look at check A and B and C, it's all about bills. It's all about getting your bills paid for. And that's generally what stimulus packages have always been. It is along the landscape that some people sort of come on the front and said, hey, I don't care. Who cares about my bills? I just want a check. EIDL, not just a, not just a check. Uh, PUA, UI, LWA, 
Um, I can go over all the lists of all the stimulus packages since 2020. 99.999% of them were all about to pay a bill. And if you have bills, that is where I am here to help. If you just want to check to just go buy something, that's generally not how stimulus packages were structured ever. And while you may think about, well, I got a $600 check, guess what? These are not $600 checks. These are $60,000 checks. And that these are for people who have expenses like you do. And with that, let's go to the incredible details in the second half with food. And keep on dropping your great questions. I'll be answering them across the board. One of the greatest things to understand about bread is that it comes in many flavors. And it comes in a lot of deliciousness. And who's in the live chat has always said, Ellie, where do you get that olive bread? That delicious jalapeno a cheese bread. So here we go. We got it right on set today. Deliciousness of bread. If bread is going up in price, as featured on tonight's on Eaters LA, why not get some good, delicious bread? How much is this bread? Uh, $3.99. Pretty good. Pretty good price point. I mean, this is this is a high-end bread. It's $3.99. So we're below, we're below the inflationary mark on this bread. What is this bread called? This is actually called focaccia jalapeno cheddar bread. They call it focaccia jalapeno cheddar bread. Let me put a little closer to the camera. I know the lights are sort of distorting the color, so it looks sort of like mustard yellow. It's not that mustardy. It's more in the orange tone. Uh, how do you choose the bread, and how do you make sure it's going to taste good? Now, I have ironically gotten this bread at the same market chain, but in different locations. And i got to tell you, it tastes totally different, which location you get the bread at same ingredients looks exactly in the package so what do i do when i buy the bread first i do it sort of like how i did the cinnamon roll show the other day i look on the outside now, how much jalapeno you give me on this uh one two three four five six, six, six. okay so i can count like 16 jalapenos uh a little a little chintzy on the jalapeno don't you think a little chintzy on the jalapeno but um I'm not going to fret on it. I can throw some more jalapenos on top of it. How about the cheese? Now, the cheese is really good. There's a lot of cheese on this. So we're sort of like almost two for two. Next, the freshness. We know it's fresh because it's made that that day. Um, but how about, uh, you know, it's packaged on April 4th, sold on, uh, and I bought on April 4th, or I, someone got it for April 4th. How about the freshness? Squeeze the bread. Squeeze it like your Charmin. Uh, squeeze your squeeze your jalapeno bread like a Charmin. Does it squeeze well? Uh, this one did. It did. I have other. I, I have seen other jalapeno breads that squeeze better. Meaning that in the baking process, they let it rise better. It has much more not more freshness, but softer to it. So I think this could have been a little bit um, squeezier, and I think there could have been some more jalapenos on it. Great, really delicious. You've never bought that type of bread. Don't know what to choose. Choose something that has a lot going on. Here is olive parmesan focaccia bread looks sort of like the last one and yet they call this parmesan is it really parmesan uh not really it's sort of a version of parmesan but you can clearly tell by holding up the two breads that the cheeses are quite different let's see if i can hold them up straight you can see this is a lighter cheese a whiter cheese this is more a yellow cheese so the olive focaccia parmesan will it taste dramatically different no this is not enough parmesan going on for it to taste so dramatically different it's the olive that's really going to pop on the flavor so doesn't have a lot of olives this does have a lot of olives this does have an all olives is it softer it is a little bit softer same price point same price point as well now there's another bread that they sell in the same market that is a version of this it is olives and it's sun-dried tomatoes opt for that or opt for this one i opted for both and i gotta tell you the olive, the, the sun-dried tomatoes, which I don't really have to have on my on my bread, it made a big difference. It really made a big difference because this one was, you know, it was two flavors, Parmesan and the olive, and adding the sun-dried tomatoes is really good across the board. Okay, so here is another version. Here you just saw the Parmesan with the olive. Here is just the Parmesan. Good, mm, it's good. Um, here's my criticism of it. Um. The Parmesan is a little bit flat in, in taste, so it's not that robust. See how thick it is? It's really thick. So this is where the problem is going to kick in. It's really thick. See how thick that is? 
And so this is going to have a very bad, this is going to have a dryness to it. It's going to dry out. I don't care how quickly you buy it. It's going to dry out. It's also a little bit heavy, which is good. I mean, it goes further on the dollar, uh, your investment, <laughs> your investment, your investment in the, in the Parmesan bread will have a higher investment rate than Bitcoin. <laughs> It just, you know, it's going to last longer because it is such a dense, thick bread. This is not a skinny, cheap bread. This is a thick bread. Um, how do you solve these problems? Well, first, microwave is your friend. If the bread is this dense, if it is this dense and has a dryness, as this one does right now, it's dry. Put it in the microwave. Softens it up. It is almost like a pizza-type bread often. So that microwave, just 20 seconds, will soften it up. You'll be shocked how much better it is. Next, olive oil. Douse it with olive oil. Put it in a bowl and douse it with some olive oil. Then put it in the microwave. Wow, really lights up. You got some extra sun-dried tomatoes in the can. We featured them on the channel before. Throw them on top, just a little bit. Bam. You like jalapenos. Then throw a few jalapenos on top. Bam. It really pulls it up. And you have really gotten the core. You got in the cheese bread. And you really brought it up a notch. Now, let's go over price point. This is where it gets interesting. Is this cheese bread... The same price point or cheaper than these, which have all the extra stuff on them. No, same price. Same price. So a lot of the menu, a lot of the supermarkets just don't have time to think about the price point. They'll be uh, three nine nine this, three nine nine that, three nine this, and they're very very different products. Um, and that is why the one that had the, the sun dried tomatoes also three ninety nine and the olives had a lot more going on for the same price point than just the basic cheese bread. That is why you always really want to go with the product that has the most going on for that price point, and that ultimately you can add on to it and grow it across the board. Just jump in the live chat, talk, tell me what type of cheese bread you ha like and what type of cheese bread you're trying to stay away from. And then if you have questions as well about your stimulus, um, I'll be answering your questions as well throughout the video. What's important to understand is that cheese bread has a lot of different forms and a lot of different cities. And it depends on which market you go to, what part of the country you are. A lot of countries approach this totally different depending on what part of the United States you're in. A lot of different approaches to the cheese bread um, based upon certainly the cheese of your state and also where you're located. The cheese is a lot cheaper in different parts of the country than others as, as well. Here's Anne. Oh, I'd love some sunrise tomatoes. I've never seen that bread. Oh, yeah, it is delicious, Anne. Um, Aloha. I'm Lisa from South Carolina. Hello, Lisa. How are you? Let's see some more of the questions. Um, I can't believe she'll be 31 in September. <laughs> the bread? Yeah, the bread is turning 31 in September. It's just, it's a very old bread. There's Gary. Hey, Gary. Welcome to becoming a part of this family. <laughs> Uh, LA's in, eating in front of us. How rude. Yeah, I'm eating right in front of you. It's just, it's the wonders of, of live TV. <laughs> um, what's important to understand is that when you're getting the bread, don't be afraid of modifying the bread. Don't be afraid of modifying the bread. You know, the sun-dried tomatoes I feature on this channel, the, the skinny jar, you can get it from your online retailer, your big box retailer shipped to your home. Very cheap, $2 a bottle. $2 a bottle. And it'll last about, you know, about two weeks. It has a lot in there. Sun-dried tomatoes, that one also is like 99 cents. Very, very cheap. So, I mean, um, jalapenos, about 99 cents. Ship it and just throw it on there. Ways to, uh, to take your, your cheese bread up a notch. Olives, black, pitted, not green, please. <laughs> uh, jalapenos, sun-dried tomatoes. Uh, and, uh, I, I, and sometimes some people like sardines olive oil, garlic powder, and other cheeses. Make it very simple. Then you can go with your, nat with your nature elements. Um, some green onions, dice them up and throw them on top. Some fresh uh, on, the, on the vine tomatoes. Don't go for the non on the vine. They don't have as much kick in them. Salt and pepper, maybe if you want to really bring it up a notch. And trust me, the price point is really good. Now, when comparing this to your pizza. This is where it gets sort of the uh, sort of in interesting economy of scale. If you go to some of your pizza retailers, you can get a very nice pizza now for five ninety nine or six ninety nine, and that pizza will be this big. Whereas this cheese bread is this big, so this is a higher uh, market price upstream product. 
than a than a basic pizza. And so if you want to feed a lot of people in a family, go for the pizza because you're getting a lot of bread, you're getting a lot of tomato, you're getting a lot of surface to start with, and you can add to it. If you need to feed a lot of people, don't start with this because this is not a meal. It's sort of like a side item, and it won't serve in the way in which a pizza can for, uh, for a family of two or three. You can really build on it and take it to another lodge. Let's jump into the live chat and see any other questions you have across the board um, from viewers in today. I love this super grocery cheese bread made in France. Oh, sounds wonderful. Garlic bread all the way, says Lisa Vaughn. <laughs> sounds great. Uh, Dad and SJ. Hey, welcome to becoming a new Purple Hawk. Dad and SJ. Uh, another person said yes to the garlic bread. Flip it and then toast it with the Parmesan. Sounds deliciousness. Sounds incredible across the board. Finally, some of my commentary today as we go into a big afternoon's LA broadcast and a, and a, and a big evening's LA show at 5 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. The, you're going to see today that this economy is literally a mess to predict. It's really a messy environment to predict. You're going to see on evening's LA tonight that there is literally a whole slew of economic data and you don't know why the number is one way or the other. For example, today the price of Brent crude and the price of West Texas gasoline, which is the price you pay at the pump, down dramatically. And you may say, oh, it's because that thing that Biden did two weeks ago. Nope. It's because of that oil deal done last weekend where the partner allies are going to release some oil. Nope. It's because China is going on lockdown because of the Omicron subvariant. Yeah. And if you don't know why something is happening, then you will get stuck on the wrong side of the equation. Bitcoin is down under $41,000 a coin again. Crypto has just been a flat industry. You know, if you think about it, it's almost a year to this day where Elon Musk appeared on Saturday Night Live. To, and everyone was saying that Doge was going to go to a dollar. It never went to a dollar. And it was no less than two weeks ago where they said Doge was surging. It was laughable then. Doge, which I had covered on this channel for over a year, was 21 cents at, at its best, you know, at its best of its worst days, because it had a lot of bad days. It surged up to 19 cents, and that got a big news story. Coins have gone flat all year. If you're looking at tech today, tech stocks are very down today. Why? Because the economy is very topsy-turvy. And with that topsy-turviness, you have the consumer price index and the C and the producer price index released Tuesday and Wednesday this week. They're likely to show that inflation is still going up. I'll have the PPI and CPI out of China on Evening's LA today. It was really hot, meaning that inflation is hotter. And j Powell, he's going to do it wrong. He's going to raise interest rates, and he's not going to solve inflation because inflation is being caused by supply chain getting the products from the port to your home. And if you can't solve the supply chain, then we still have inflation. What's important for you to understand is that when there's checks available, you need to cash them. You need to cash them right now. And you can't look out on the horizon and think about a check that's not law and ask, when is that check a law? When there's checks that you qualify for right today that you can get. Those incredible checks are check A, B, and C, and you deserve them and you should get them. A $6,500 stimulus check became a law just a few weeks ago. Adults, go get it. It is for you. $15,000 to $80,000 check. Adults, go get it. It became a stimulus check. It includes SSI and veterans and SSA. Go get it. And then if you're a renter, go get it. MSC checks. Biggest on this channel. Biggest pot of money you're ever going to see in this channel, potentially throughout 2022. Many viewers getting on average $45,000 of these MSC checks. Some viewers getting over $150,000 of them. These are the big checks you want to get. They're the checks reality right now. And when new checks become a law, they are slid into this broadcast and slid into the membership newsletter. That comes Monday through Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time via the YouTube alert system. And if you become a member... You get that information as soon as it becomes law, so you get your application on file as quickly as possible and get funded as countless viewers have. Purple Hawk, Purple Power, or Casino VIP. Coming up next is the 1 o'clock edition of Afternoons L8, then a brand new evenings L Afternoons L8 at 3 o'clock, and then evenings L8 in prime time at 5 o'clock Pacific Standard Time. Stay informed. Stay hungry. Stay with the carbs. Mm. Deliciousness. 
and stay throughout the day as LA continues. See you back on Afternoons LA starting in just a few minutes throughout the day. And stay with LA for more. <laughs>